1st of August 2022. Top 5 Evening Headlines Cabinet approves signing in Mao between India and Nepal. India or S first vaccine against cervical cancer to be launched on the 1st of September. Arvind Kejriwal launches India or S first virtual school for students. Former Soviet leader Mikhail Gorbachev passes away. Bajaj Finance, Adani Transmission in top 10 most valued firms. Cabinet approves signing in Mao between India and Nepal. The Union Cabinet has approved an Environment Ministry proposal for signing in Mao with Nepal on biodiversity conservation. The Mao would help in promoting cooperation between India and Nepal in the field of forests, wildlife, environment, biodiversity conservation and climate change, including restoration of corridors and interlinking areas, and sharing knowledge and best practices. India's first vaccine against cervical cancer to be launched on the 1st of September. In a first, India will get its first vaccine against cervical cancer on September 1st, 2022. The cervical cancer vaccine, quadrivalent human papillomavirus vaccine QHPV, has been developed by the Serum Institute of India SII and the Department of Biotechnology DBT. It will be launched by the Union Minister of State Independent Charged Science or Technology Jitendra Singh. Arvind Kejriwal launches India's first virtual school for students. Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal on 31 August 2022 launched country or as first virtual school. Students from all across the country will be eligible for admission. The school is for classes 9 to 12 and the application process for the Delhi Model Virtual School DMVS began on the same day. The classes will be online and recorded lectures will also be uploaded online. Former Soviet leader Mikhail Gorbachev passes away. The former Soviet leader Mikhail Gorbachev passed away in August 2022. Mr. Gorbachev became General Secretary of the Soviet Communist Party and de facto leader of the country in 1985. At the time, he was the youngest member of the ruling council known as the Politburo. He won the Nobel Peace Prize for negotiating a historic nuclear arms pact with US leader Ronald Reagan. Bajaj Finance, Adani Transmission in Top 10 Most Valued Firms LIC is no longer part of the top 10 companies by market capitalization as it has been replaced by Bajaj Finance and Adani Transmission. LIC holds 11th spot in the list, whereas Bajaj Finance and Adani Transmission have taken 10th and 9th spot, respectively, in the overall ranking. Adani Transmission entered the list with a market value of 4.43 lakh rupees crore on the BSE as on August 30, 2022. Mao signed between NHL ML and Katra Development Authority. And Mao has been signed between NHL ML National Highways Logistics Management Limited and Katra Development Authority. As part of the initiative, intermodal station is being developed in Katra to improve the travelling experience of pilgrims who are visiting Mata Vaishno Devi Temple. Boft is developing these stations across the country for improving passenger infrastructure development. Mercedes-Benz India appoints Santosh Ayer as new MD. Mercedes-Benz has appointed Santosh Ayer as the Managing Director and CEO of the Indian Operations with effect from January 1, 2023. He is currently working as Vice President, Sales or Marketing and would be the first Indian to lead Mercedes-Benz India Operations. Ayer will replace Martin Schwenk who will assume the responsibility as the President and CEO of Mercedes-Benz Thailand. IMF money reaches Pakistan on the 29th of August 2022. The International Monetary Fund IMF convened a meeting of its executive board on August 29, 2022 to approve a bailout package for cash starved Pakistan. This includes a disbursement of about 1.18 billion United States dollars. The IMF had announced on July 13 a staff-level agreement with Pakistan on a nine-month extension in tenor and a US$1 billion United States dollars increase in the size of the bailout package to US$7 billion. United States dollars.
know about international monetary fund international monetary fund or imf is an international financial institution and an agency of un it is headquartered in washington dc us it was formed on the 27th of december 1945 it consists of 190 countries as members